So I recently left my job to pursue YouTube. There's a lot to think about and a lot of sacrifices have been made when embracing such a huge change, be it a lifestyle change or hobbies. For me, my main source of income. If you ask me if it's scary, I would say it's very, very scary. But I think what's scarier is if I know what I want to pursue and not being able to take the first step, the feeling of knowing what I will miss out and not becoming who I want to be in the future is even more scary. So today's video is slightly different. I'm talking to the camera, I'm talking to you guys. Hopefully by documenting my journey can inspire some of you guys out there. So yeah, I need to get some coffee beans. So why not bring you guys along? I think everyone has faced a situation before where they either have to take a leap of faith or take the easy way out. So for me, I have been doing some vlogs and speaking to camera like this is quite crazy for me. So if you ask me, it's really not easy but I mean, just gonna do it. I've always been someone who likes to try new things but the one thing I fear the most is what will other people think about me? I think many of us have a similar fear Like everyone is judging our every movement Whatever we say For me, I didn't want to speak to the camera because of my poor English language And also partly because of my Singaporean accent I'm not sure if you guys can understand what I'm actually saying But at the end of the day, I wanted to build meaningful connections with my audience So I myself have to change And what better way to talk about change than to embrace it myself get something cold because I'm sweating. Alright, see ya. So talking about change, what I've learned so far is the first step is always the hardest and then subsequently, it's all about growth from there. For me, I started off on Instagram. It took me a while to learn the ropes regarding editing, knowing what people like to see and watch. Same goes for YouTube. And from Instagram, two videos actually went viral. So I sort of knew what worked and what didn't. So I took the opportunity and produced more of that content. But all this wouldn't have happened if I didn't start at all. And when you try enough, when the opportunity comes, you'll be able to act on it. And that's what I think sets you apart from the rest. And well, this is actually good. All I can say is, be prepared when the opportunity comes and be patient. Patiently waiting on my dreams to come true. Hoping and praying one day that they do oh, I don't know how and I don't know when Just patiently waiting till then Won't be surprised if it rains later Because the weather these few days has been a bit crazy Don't know where you came from, but this road is yours to trail. Made to mold into a song that sounds. A friend of mine actually once told me that if 
things don't work out, it's not difficult to go back to where we were before. If we don't even take the first step, all this wouldn't even matter. And the constant thought that what you're missing out is, is gonna suck. I totally get the pressure, the judgement, especially from where I am. Not having a stable job is not something to be proud of. However, from what I've learned from the past three years is that whatever job we have is not guaranteed. It can be taken away from us at any point in time. Change is gonna happen either way, so why not just go for what you wanna do. There was a book I read recently that said we often tend to forget that whatever we do now and the habits we have will greatly affect our future self. Something about that sentence stuck with me till this day. In a fast-paced world, many of us tend to follow the conventional route because it's deemed as safe. Even though I'm currently unemployed now, my vision for the future is clearer than before despite knowing that there's a long road ahead. But one thing's for sure is that I'm glad that you guys are here to witness my journey. Please don't let anyone dictate your path. Follow your heart and your future self will thank you for that. Like this book. I'm curious to know what's one thing that you always wanted to start but never seemed to take the first step. So please feel free to comment down below, I'm excited to read them. Okay, I think that's it for today's video. This video is a huge one for me and I hope you enjoyed watching it. So I'll see you in the next one. So you can, so, so, so. And at the end, of, and we end up, and we end up. Yeah.